Many talks have been given by our church leaders on charity, unity, love, kindness, compassion, forgiveness, and mercy. I believe the Savior is inviting us to live a higher, holier way, His way of love, where all can feel they truly belong and are needed. We are commanded to love others, not to judge them. Let's lay down that heavy burden. It isn't ours to carry. Instead, we can pick up the Savior's yoke of love and compassion. Come unto me, all ye that labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn of me, for my yoke is easy and my burden is light. The Savior does not condone sin, but offers us His love and extends forgiveness when we repent. To the woman caught in adultery, He said, Neither do I condemn thee. Go and sin no more. Those He touched felt His love, and that love healed and transformed them. His love inspired them to want to change their lives. Living His way brings joy and peace, and He invited others to that way of living with gentleness, kindness, and love. Let us remember that each person on this earth is a child of God, and He loves each one. Are there people in your path who you have felt inclined to judge? If so, Remember that these are valuable opportunities for us to practice loving as the Savior loves. As we follow His example, we can be yoked with Him and help foster a feeling of love and belonging in the hearts of all our Father's children.